emblazoned in the annals of football history, today marks the day when a star shone brighter than ever. Cole Palmer, the Chelsea midfielder, unleashed an extraordinary performance on the field that will be remembered for years to come. It was a day of reckoning for Everton as they faced a relentless Chelsea. The Blues, led by the phenomenal talent of Palmer, dominated the field, leaving no stone unturned. With a first-half hat-trick, Palmer set the stage on fire, leaving the spectators and the opposing team in a state of awe. The game ended with him scoring a total of four goals, a feat that is as daunting as it is impressive. But the glory wasn't just Palmer's alone. Nicholas Jackson and Alfie Gilchrist also etched their names on the scoreboard, contributing to the overwhelming 6-0 thrashing of Everton. The outcome has not only highlighted Chelsea's resurgence in form, but also the undeniable prowess of their squad. On the other side, Everton, now teetering at the 16th spot in the league, felt the weight of this heavy defeat. Their precarious position just above the relegation zone paints a picture of a tough battle ahead. The loss has underlined the pressing need for a strategic reboot if they are to avoid the jaws of relegation. In the aftermath of the match, Chelsea boss Mauricio Pochettino heaped praise on Palmer. His exceptional performance stood as a testament to his potential and a promise of what the future holds. Such an exhilarating match has not just been a spectacle for football fans, but also a game-changer in the current league standings. Chelsea's victory has bolstered their push for a European spot a testament to their unwavering determination and skill. In conclusion, this match serves as a stark reminder of the unpredictable nature of football. It's a game where heroes are made, where each match can turn the tide, where every goal counts. And for Cole Palmer, it was a day when he rose above the rest, etching his name in golden letters in the history of football. What a day it has been. What a match it has been.